What makes cloud-based products secure? To answer that, let's look at the types of attacks on clouds and how they defend themselves. One common attack is called a sniffing attack. Just as you could overhear a conversation between two people, an attacker can use special tools on his computer to eavesdrop on your wireless communications. The attacker will position himself within range of the wireless access point you're connected to and use a program called a sniffer to capture information. The attacker can do this without being noticed. The data will still travel from one computer to another, but he can also capture it. This makes sniffing attacks dangerous because the computers can send and receive every bit of information without knowing that an attacker saw it too. Clouds defend against this type of attack with encryption. In the same way you might lock valuables in a safe with a key, your computer locks information inside of a digital container with a digital key. Today's encryption uses very complex mathematics, but it's based on principles used for over 2,000 years. In ancient Rome, soldiers used an encryption technique called the Caesar cipher to send messages to each other. The sender would encrypt the message according to a secret procedure. While the message was in transit, anyone who saw it wouldn't know what it meant. The receiver, however, knew the procedure was to move a certain number of positions down the alphabet for every letter so he could decrypt it. Since the attacker doesn't know the procedure or the number of positions to move, he won't be able to understand the message. Encryption has two parts, the procedure used, which is also called an algorithm, and a digital key that the algorithm uses. Modern encryption techniques such as AES-256 also uses an algorithm and a key just like the Caesar cipher. AES stands for Advanced Encryption Standard and 256 describes the key. Computers are capable of millions of calculations per second, so good encryption such as AES-256 contains very complex mathematical algorithms and very long keys, far too complex to explain with a whiteboard and a marker. The computer prepares the message by encrypting it according to the algorithm and key. As it travels through the air, the attacker may still capture the data, but without the key, he won't be able to decrypt it. Even if the attacker knows the algorithm used, he will still not be able to decrypt the message without the key. The attacker can't be stopped from sniffing the data, but he can be prevented from reading the data that he sniffed. Encryption protects against sniffing attacks by scrambling data according to an algorithm and a key so that recipients can only understand it if they have the corresponding key. For more information about Allegiant's portfolio of web-enabled products, such as the NDE series Wireless Lock with Engage Technology, visit www.allegiantengage.com.